Captain Humphreys. Yes, sir. Good to see you. Hello, sir. Your first duty here on the installation, I take it, right? Yes, sir. Cool. How appropriate that you are out here uh, doing the last major fence move on the installation is the namesake of the of the installation. Cool. Yes, sir. do today is bring about 900 acres of land inside the installation. This 900 acres of land you're actually standing on right now. This is a big deal for the United States government all the way up to the strategic level and the Republic of Korea because what it signifies to us collectively is that we are finishing USAG Humphreys. We're bringing the last 900 acres inside the installation. And you're all making it happen. This is an historic day for our army in Korea. So Quay, what do you think about your new PX? Huge. It's huge, isn't it? Yes, sir. Have you ever been in a PX this big before? No, sir. <laughs> so, when I was in here before they put all the walls up, I pasted it off. And it's 200 meters wide, and it's almost 200 meters deep. It's a lot of stuff you could buy in here. Yes, sir. And this is the back end of the commissary, so you can see the loading dock. You, you could fit the current Humphreys commissary inside this new commissary four times. That's how big the, uh, this commissary is going to be. Well, this is uh, a monumental ACP, the Dodori ACP. Uh, we finally get it accepted inside the installation. It'll be great. It'll, you'll get a lot of traffic through here, but, but this will be a key feature because Highway 17, right over here, they're about ready to open that up. We flew over that uh, the other day, and uh, they're doing all of the, you know, wiring out there for all of the lighting, et, et cetera. So that's, uh, that'll be important for us as far as the commute between here and Seoul goes. So the original design that they had for these was they were supposed to be built just like the rest of the concrete structures that are cast in place. And the contractor came back and said, hey, we have a way to be able to do this more efficiently, um, more quickly. So what they're doing is they're casting the panels off-site, and then they bring them in and they assemble them. What's amazing to me is that, you know, you get concrete exteriors on these buildings. I mean, they're going to last for a long, long, long time. So one year ago when we were out here, um, or a little bit, I guess a little bit longer than one year ago, we were out here uh, doing the uh, big clearance operation for the 1,200 acres we brought in then. Um, this was nothing but dirt. There, there, was no e there wasn't even any prep work out here. And uh, just over one year's time, and you've got a warehouse that, you know, it's probably about in the 50% threshold for completion right now. You get the, most of the walls up. They still have a bunch of the walls to put up in here. Are you trooping them around? Okay. For your next tour in Korea, you'll actually be able to go in process at the one stop, come out of the one stop, go across the street, because you're the bank and the finance is right there, okay? Then walk across the canal, you can see that bridge being built right there, and walk into this new downtown area. This area, this, these facilities out here, are commensurate and built with in, intended for you because of your service. When you go back to the States, if you re-up to go back to Fort Bliss, Fort Polk, wherever you're going to go, there's not going to be any place like being here in Humphreys, okay? 
It is really going to be nice. In fact, you know, even if you ETS and go off to do great and wonderful things after you ETS, you'll look at this place and you'll remember it and you'll say, wow, there's nothing like being here.